Scandinavian Defense, Mises Kodrick, Main Line. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. White played the opening well, but Black was on another level. Both players navigated the middle game well. Both players had incredible precision in the end game. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. The Scandinavian defense immediately challenges the center by attacking the e4 pawn. The best move is x5, which widens the middle. If black captures on d5 with the queen, white will gleefully use nc3 to assault the queen. Qxd5 moves the queen to the center, where it has influence over many crucial squares, and recaptures the d5 pawn. nc3 develops the knight toward the center and immediately attacks the queen, this knight move also starts the fight for the e4 square. qa5 removes the attacked queen from the center after white moves their d pawn to d4 or d3, the knight on c3 will be pinned. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. As a result, the bishop grows and gains flexibility on the long diagonal. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is the final book action. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. It is quite good. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is best. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. It is ideal. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. That's good. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. It is ideal. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. That's good. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. A solid choice. It is excellent. The rooks are linked by this, making it easier for them to work together in the future. It is quite good. This exchange is fair. It is quite good. Backs off. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. That's fine. It is good. That is a logical response. It is quite good. Among the best actions. It is quite good. A rook enters the action after developing outside of its starting square as a result. It is quite good. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is ideal. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. That's good. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. A very strong play. It is excellent. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. The pawn is now on a square that is safer. That's good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Backs off. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is ideal. This threatens to reveal an attack on a queen. This permits the opponent to create a passed pawn. It is an inaccuracy. The pawn is now passed because it can no longer be challenged by opposing pawns as it tries to promote. It is best. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This defends a piece that is being attacked but is not well defended. It is ideal. This misses a chance to make a pawn winning threat. It is incorrect. This is not the best. 
it is an inaccuracy. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. This blocks an attack on a vulnerable pawn. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to defend a queen that was under attack. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a queen. It is a mistake. There was only one good move there. This ignores an opportunity to block a check from the opposing queen. It is a miss. Recaptures. It is ideal. This reveals an assault and puts a pawn in danger. It is quite good. This confines the opponent's king while also moving a rook to the 7th rank, activating it. It is ideal. This misses a chance to suggest winning a rook. It is incorrect. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. That's good. Very precise. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This captures a vulnerable pawn. It is best. This buys time by putting a knight in danger and getting it to flee. It is ideal. This protects the attacked knight. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This wins time by threatening a rook and forcing it to move away. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This move puts the rook on a safer square. This threatens to kick a knight. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This ignores an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is a mistake. This misses an opportunity to connect rooks. It is a miss. There was only one good move in that position. This overlooks an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is a miss. This ignores a better way to add a defender to a vulnerable knight. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is an inaccuracy. This wins a tempo by threatening a rook and forcing it to move away. It is best. This is a poor choice for rook safety movement. It is incorrect. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. There was just one smart move to be made. This is a missed chance to offer an equal exchange of goods. It is incorrect. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. This permits the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a miss. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. This was a game-changing move, giving white a winning position. It is a great move. A solid choice. It is excellent. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This ignores an opportunity to push a passed pawn towards promotion. This allows the opponent to activate the king by getting it off of the back rank. It is a mistake. Recaptures. The end game has begun, and black is worse. It is ideal. So, a knight is attached to the king. That's good. This protects an underdefended knight that is under attack. This is the only good move. It is a great move. A chance to advance a passed pawn towards promotion is lost in this. It is incorrect. That is a logical response. It is quite good. An active king is critical in the end game and getting it off of the back rank is the first step. It is good. That's fine. It is good. A passed pawn is pushed by this. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is ideal. This threatens to reveal an attack on a rook while also checking the king. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This prevents the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a rook while also checking the king. It is excellent. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is quite good. Backs off. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. That's a decent move. That's good. A passed pawn is pushed by this. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. That's good. This is the only move that works. 
it is a great move. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. This is the only good move. It is a great move. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. Give away one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. White played the opening well, but black was on another level. Both players navigated the middle game well. Both players had incredible precision in the end game. 